welcome again to my channel organic and hydroponic urban grow club friends today we are going to talk about preparing a nursery for growing cabbage and cauliflower into our hydroponic system friends cabbage and cauliflower can grow very well into different hydroponic system and in specifically they can grow well into nft or dft or deep water culture system and for growing into this system we need to grow this plants into the net cups so first we need to make the nursery and then we can transplant this small plants into the net cup and shift it to the our hydroponic system but today in this video i will demonstrate you a different method which is simple and short i am going to share you the method of growing the seedling directly into the net cup and preparing the good healthy nursery for good transplant into the hydroponic system so to know each of the step in detail please stay connected to the video till the end let's start this video now for the first step of preparing nursery we need to fill the net cups with the coco peat media for that we have a net cup like this these are with the hole at the bottom and all the sides are open like this and here is the coco peat which we have moisture to the level that upon squeezing there no water drip and at the same time it is well moisture so this is the condition we need to made for the coco peat now simply we need to fill this cup with this coco peat but at the filling we will ensure that the coco peat fill properly no air gap should be there so we are filling little extra pressing it from the top and again removing all the excess coco peat from the net cup so we are scraping off from the top cleaning from the side and arranging into one tray where we can water them so this is how we need to fill all the cup first then we'll start our seed sowing work so now we have just completed our net cup filling work and now this tray is ready for sowing the seed now we'll start sowing the seed and for sowing the seed first we'll make the small hole into all each of the net cup either with a finger or with some pencil or some stick we need to ensure that this hole is around half centimeter deep so that whatever seed we put into this will remain into moisture zone so that its germination process start quickly also the coco peat is drying fast so if we do the very shallow cavity then also the seed will not germinate well now we have this seed with us these are cabbage seeds you can see this now we can put either one seed or two seed if we put one seed then we can directly put this cup to the our dft channels but we are putting two seeds so that we can select one strong one and remove the weaker one or remove the another one if it is both are strong and sow it somewhere else so we are right now we are putting two seed into each of the cavity so this is how we need to spread all the seed into all the net cups then once the seed work seed sowing work is over we'll cover this seed and put this tray into the germination area at the time of germination for the germination we need to cover this tray so that the moisture will not lose from this tray but first we need to sow all this seed like this so we are putting two seeds per cavity so now our seed sowing work is over now we need to cover this seeds gently with the same coco peat and again press it lightly so that this each seed will have a strong contact with the media and they start taking water and start its germination process after completing this we will put this tray with covering into the side with a little dark place so that its germination or sprouting will take place and as soon as the sprouting will take place we'll spread this tray into the open to sunlight area so this is the completion so now our seed sowing work is over and we are going to put this tray for the germination in a side now we are going to put this tray over here it's a little dark place and little cool place and now we are going to cover this tray with the help of this 
plastic cloth. We have this plastic coat with us and we are going to cover this tray with this. This is we are covering so that the moisture retain into this all the net cup into the cocoa pit. Also it will create a dark area which will help the germination process. So after this we need to take a two care for this nursery. The first thing we need to maintain the moisture. So if you see the top surface of the cocoa pit is drying then we can spray some water with a fine spray and keep it moist. Second as soon as the plant we show the sprouting sign we need to remove this cover and put this tray into the sunlight. This is how the once the sunlight is get on the plants they will grow strong it will not grow leggy. So this care will give us the very good seedling or plantation to transfer into our hydroponic system. So friends this is how you can also grow a seedling from the seed for the cabbage and cauliflower and grow it into your hydroponic system. So now it has been two days since we have put the seeds for the germination. Now today we will see how the position of this seed into this net cups. Once we open this cover and we can immediately see that lot of sprouting is there into this cabbage and cauliflower plant. You can see all these sprouts are coming out. So this is the stage where we need to remove this cover and put this plant into sunlight. So they can grow sturdy. Also you can see that as of now the good moisture is there. So we need not to water immediately. But if the top layer of the cocoa pit is drying up then we need to give some water to this plant. Now onwards we will grow this plant up to the four leaf means two cotyledon and two of the true leaf. Once they reach to the two of the true leaf and the root coming out of this cup we are going to shift it to the required hydroponic system. But right now this sprouting is well and we have got the good success with this method. So friends how do you like this method of directly growing seed into the net cup? Please write me back into the comment box. And if you like my method of this growing directly seed into the cup and reduce the labor, then please give me the thumb on the video and subscribe my channel also and share it with your friends. So they can also take advantage of this system and grow their seedlings well. You can also follow this method and grow cabbage and cauliflower directly into net cup and in a short period you can get the good seedling from it. Happy growing!